You know, we talk a lot about being healthy and staying healthy, but we have to acknowledge and talk about not feeling so great, not feeling the greatest for whatever reason, for whatever reason. So, yeah, today, well, in the past few days, actually, it's been feeling just lightheaded and just like about to like like pass out and it's just like so like sudden and it mostly happens when I do any sort of physical activity so in the morning when I usually run that is when I end up feeling a bit lightheaded and well as, as I'm running I feel perfectly fine as I'm running the moment I stop that is when I start to feel lightheaded and it, and it becomes like I'm about to like pass out and I get like really cool like my body just just starts to feel like cold and I just like have to like stop and just take or take a break but it's only after I stop running like like if I continue to run I'll probably be fine but the moment I stop that's when I'm just like about to like pass out and today I I've, I've had to kind of like sit down on on the on the ground essentially just having to deal with that but it started, I want to say Thursday or Friday of last week. Okay, I think it was Friday is when I noticed it when I went r- running. And then Saturday, I was feeling lightheaded in the afternoon without any sort of physical activity. And then I went walking with a friend and I was feeling pretty bad for about half of it. Then I felt better. Sunday, I did no physical activity that contributed to the, the lightheadedness. It just kind of happened towards the evening and then it kind of went away and then this morning today you know I went out when I'm running and then I felt that way and it was just like terrible and I, I just don't understand what contributes to it I, I, I know plenty of people have said and I've even thought yo oh maybe maybe it's the heat this past week or so has not been the hottest it has been here it has been far hotter before and I've gone running out in that and been perfectly fine I'm drinking plenty of water I'm making sure that I'm staying hydrated so I don't know what is contributing to it. I don't know what is causing it. I, I, I don't have a clue. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's the, uh, maybe it's that CV vax, you know? Maybe it has all, all the blood clots in my lungs. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? No. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? What is that, like 63% of people get them? Yeah. Hmm. Anyway, <laughs> who knows? I don't know the answer to that. But regardless, it's just interesting how it just kind of came up all of a sudden here. Maybe it's all the mosquito bites I've been getting. I guess I've been filming all the other little videos of all the bunny outside and I'm just getting tons. I literally have, if I counted, probably like 20 or 30 mosquito bites on my legs. It's insane. It really is. So maybe maybe that's given me some sort of disease, or maybe it's, or maybe they were carrying the CV vax. Who knows? They could have been. They could have been. You, you know, uh, Mr. Gates and all of his stuff that he does, the GMO mosquitoes and everything. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I didn't want it to turn into that sort of topic, but. I'm just saying, who who knows? Who knows what's causing this? I, you know, there's so many possibilities. It could be drinking plenty of water, so that's not it. Um, you know, eating just fine. Uh, you know, uh, no idea, no idea. But regardless, it is annoying because I want to go out and exercise. I want to go out and run and feel fine, but then I got to stop. I got to go slow after I after I run. I can't really do what I used to do, and it just like oh, it just feels terrible. It really does. So. Anyway, you all take care of it. Have a great one. That's just an update for today. So I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.